Look at somebody and say, I am unstoppable. Whatever you thought you lost, whatever is taken from you, God will compensate you. All things work together for good to those who are called according to his what? Purpose. All things. May your life attract people that have something to do with your destiny. Zara spirit. Do you know who Zara spirit is? Absalom spirit. Absalom sat at the gate. Manipulated people. Do you know he succeeded in overthrowing his father? He overthrew his father. Why? He stole the heart of the people. Watch out anybody who has noticed me spirit that makes everybody think that is the best among the, uh, the group. Who always uh, try to, over, to, to assign the leader. If you give him time to do a small exhortation in the group, if you see how he will be vibrating so that they will say he's the one that has oil. My friend, all you flows from the head, not from the feet. All you flows from where? The head, not from the feet. If they give you a microphone here to sing, friend, sing. Just sing and be yourself. There is no display you will display here we have not seen. When you sing to prove that you have better than every other person, is the Zara spirit that is troubling you. Can I hear somebody say, cast it out? Absalom said to them, you know what? If this matter were to be me handling the matter, in three days you get answer. But you know my father, the old man, they say yes. He now began to walk on them and gathered multitude and overthrow his father. That is what God does. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Please, businessmen and women, watch out. Any staff that organizes party and to thought of the people that go there as staff, watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Zara spirit may be. Zara spirit is opportunity hijacker. Zara is a relationship stealer. Zara is a marriage kidnapper. She is a business secret hijacker. He hijacks business secret and steals marriage and destroys the relationship. That is the ministry of Zara spirit. He comes to talk. What broke Zara's spirit? What broke my parents' marriage? Is Zara's spirit. My mother's friends. They're interested. They will see my dad. Whether the person is carrying is of her, the friend's wife or they are related, they don't care to know. They will be the one to come to tell my mother. And my mother will get angry. As soon as Papa returned, fight has started. So she fought and fought and fought and fought and fought herself out of the marriage. Whoever brings story about your wife is carrying Zara spirit, may be interested in you. Whoever comes to lie to you about your wife is interested in you. How's the Zara spirit? Did you send the person a message? Is he a monitor for your wife? Is he a husband's monitor? Why are you listening? Why? Say marriage killer. Zara spirit. Steal secrets of business and go and start their own. Steal the secrets of ministry to go and start their own. But tell, let me tell you the truth. Fares is coming. Oh, you didn't hear. I say Fares is coming. 
is that our spirit always seek for a shortcut to destiny. People with this spirit do not follow normal process of arrival at destiny. Hence, they present their hand instead of their head. In Ecclesiastes chapter 9 verse 11, if you give me the living Bible, Ecclesiastes chapter 9 verse 11, very quickly, he said the fastest runner doesn't always win the race. And the strongest warrior doesn't always win the battle. I have observed something else under the sun. The fastest runner doesn't always win the race. And the shortest warrior, the strongest warrior, doesn't always win the battle. The wise sometimes go hungry and the skillful are not necessarily wealthy. And those who are educated don't always lead successful life. It is all decided by chance and by being in the right place at the right time. From being the right place at the right time. If wealth is meant for the most educated, all the professors will be multi-billionaires, but it's not. It's time and chance. Somebody say, I hear. Don't cut short. Don't, 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 don't follow shortcut. Shortcut. I told you last two weeks, shortcut. That's why you see a child, you see a small boy in his thing, 19 years, 18 years, buying a car and father won't ask mother won't ask our son has bought a car it's a shortcut it will cut him short and many of them are being really cut short there are many prophets that rose up they are all gone gone completely because they followed shortcut the kingdom of god is a process seek it first the kingdom and all these things shall be added to you. Seek first. Somebody say first. Seek first. Seek first. I think I need to conclude this in today. Seek first. Seek first. And, and something happened. And Pharaoh said no. You can't, you can't do this to me. Friend, fight for what belongs to you. Fight. 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 If you don't fight, you will miss it. That's what happened to Esau. Esau didn't fight. When, 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 when Jacob heard his heel, Israel kicked him. Get, get out. When they came to physical, when they were born, Jacob did not let go until he took the blessing. Fight. Fares means to spread. Fares means to break forth. Fares means sudden break forth. I command this morning, receive the anointing of sudden break forth. Receive the anointing of outbreak of abundance in the name of Jesus. Receive the anointing that shall cause you to break forth on the right and break forth on the left and break forth in the front and break forth on the back. And Pharaoh broke forth and the woman said, hey! Somebody say, hey! The woman shouted, how did you do it? I have declared somebody a winner. How did you overturn the person? I've declared that somebody is the owner of the land. How did you do it? Can I hear somebody shout, Hey! I am breaking forth! That's the Pharaoh spirit. It's a spirit that comes upon you to make you unstoppable. It's the anointing of unstoppability. It's the anointing of achievers. Is the anointing of men who refuse to remain on the ground even when they have fallen. That is the spirit of unstoppability. Is the anointing that says, even in my old age, I will bring forth fruit. Yes. That is the anointing. The anointing that said, it is not over yet. As long as I have not entered the grave, it's not over. I will fight in the last minute of my life. I will not give up. You may have succeeded. You succeeded on your own. You are not the custodian of my destiny. 
You didn't know the history of my life before I arrived. Before I was born, I was ordained in the womb. I was consecrated in the womb. What I become was written in heaven. I may be going through a process now. Watch me. When my product comes out, it will outshine your own. Somebody, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Every hidden destiny helper be made visible in the name of Jesus. I've come to announce to somebody that the season of celebration has just started. May your life attract people that have something to do with your destiny. This week, this week, your week of testimony unlimited testimony somebody shout and receive it I come to come to say to you this morning you are about to spread you are about to be revealed you are about to break forth you are about to be displayed for let's fight to take your position Fares break the barrier. Fares, the position is yours. Fares, your time of manifestation is now. Fares, nobody will fight for you. Fight for yourself. Somebody holler, yes. Fares, listen to me. You are about to spring a surprise to your generation. You will spring a pleasant surprise. Somebody say, I hear. <laughs> you will spring a pleasant surprise. If people will open their mouth, they wouldn't know what to say. They would know what to say. Why? The Lord God, because his agenda in your life to be manifested, if I hear your amen, amen. angels will execute the order of your life. Angels will execute the order of your life. Pharaohs, listen, Zara may have arrived first by their sharp practices, but be assured it is for a moment. It does not have the power of durability. Please give me Proverbs chapter 13, verse 11. I think that is where I'm going to stop. Give me Proverbs chapter 13, verse 11. Wealth gotten by vanity shall be diminished. But he that gathereth by labor shall do what? <laughs> See, many of us think labor is hand. Labor is here. Labor is where? In your mind. That's where labor starts. That's where labor is incubated. That is where idea comes from. Idea doesn't come from hand. Hand is just the outcome. Hand is to transform what is here into manifestation. He that gathered by labor. In Proverbs chapter 28, verse 22. Proverbs 28, 22. It says, Greedy people try to get rich quick, but don't realize they are headed for they are headed for where? Poverty. Greedy people. Greedy people. <laughs> They try to get rich quick. Quick. Listen. Maybe I have to say this. I know there are some of you that are, good, that are into forest trading in the house. Forest trading is a global market. It's not, it's not a crime. It's not 419. Forest trading. It's not. The truth about forest trading is it can make you rich and it can reduce you to poverty. And the secret where it reduces you to poverty is when people come to offer you. Listen to me what I'm going to say this morning. I, I, I'm making a statement under the anointing. Anybody trading for you on forest trading, promising you 30%, I tell you, give me six months. You will, weep. You will so cry that nobody will console you. You will lose your money. Quote me. 
Did you hear what I said? So stop this greediness because you want to be rich quick. Bring 100,000 and get 30,000. What did he do? Bring 1 million and get 300,000 in a month. Your brain is not thinking. You are not working. You are not using your coconuts. What is he going to do? If you know what forest trading is, it's a pleptic market. It's meant for those who have heart. That's what it is. It can blow you up in a week, in two weeks. You just became a millionaire. Yes, it can equally reduce you. And how it will reduce you is when you are greedy for percentage. But check people who are going through forest trading and they are slow and steady. They get 7%, 10% every month. Their money is secured. They are trading. They are trading. And they are trading. They are not ready to make, to get rich quick. They are just trading. Give them some time. One, two years, they will blow up. It's a, it's a global market. But look at what the Bible says. Greedy people try to get rich quick. But don't realize they are headed for where? Poverty. You know what happens when you get the first 30%, get the second 30%, get the third 30%, your money is complete. From the fourth and fifth, you will hear stories. At the end, it will collapse. Who will you blame? Have you not received your money back? See your head. Stand to your feet. Let me stop here. I can continue from here in the second service. I needed to talk about Pharaoh's Mashallah Baraba, Rakataba, Legrabadaba. If you get money, there is no way you will get money and you didn't follow the process. If you get that money, that is what happens. Those who are, whether you call it Yahoo, Yahoo, whether you call it 419, whether you, whatever you call it, the money just come. Their life is cut short. <laughs> Your life is what? Cut short. Where would they be to eat the money? The living. They will leave the money for the living. Who didn't know that they sold their life? They gave their life for what they will not enjoy. Lift up your hand. Say, Lord, unto you, I commit my spirit, my soul, and my body. This morning, I receive the anointing of Pharaohs. I can't hear something say, I receive the anointing of Pharaohs to fight Zara. The spirit of Zara at the gate of my breakthrough. The spirit of adversaries. I stand on your word. Every hand blocking my passage. As I pray, as I clap my hands, I break your hand. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Let me hear somebody pray. In the name of Jesus.